So here we are in our final week of December and our final week of 2022. Sunday is the start of 2023. Wow. And the prediction that I made last year for this coming or earlier this year for this coming January is game on January. Oh, yeah. Um, so this week, I want you really thinking more about what things felt right for you this year. What things did not feel right for you? Because we don't want to move forward in that direction with those same people in that same place with those same things. We're not doing that anymore. No, 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 no. We've got to get to where we fit. I think 2022 has been a really great example for us. It has showed us time and time again what felt right and what didn't. In 2020, our foundations were taken completely away from us. Everything that we had built had crumbled down to the bottom. So we had to look at, oh my goodness, how are we going to rebuild? And you start with your foundation. No longer did we want to build the same foundation in the same place with the same people. We realized there were some things we didn't need in, that, in what we had built before. So we're not using those things anymore. We're not going to build with those same people in that same way. We built differently. 2021 was about, 2020 and 21 was about building that foundation and getting it set in stone, getting it right. 2022 was about putting up those walls, starting our construction on the actual build of our own home, our own life. So 2023, we're going to continue that construction, building this new life for ourselves. We're going to get those walls up. We're going to get the roof on. Then we're going to start boxing in the walls. We're going to think about the layout, how we want our life to work, all the intricate details. And in 2023, that's what we're going to be doing really truly designing where we want to be have a great day everyone and remember we have the power to create the life we've always dreamed of we do get outside touch the earth cleanse your space do your meditations and remember this way the wolf the raven and spirit we're sending you unconditional love Mwah.